Alright, let's go. Okay. It's reporting it now. Hello, Willie. I have a couple CDs here, and I'm just gonna quickly close my eyes and pick one out. So, you're gonna have to give me your opinion of it. Okay. Okay? So, oh, look, I picked out Mariah Carey. Mariah Carey. Which album is it? This is from her album, Rainbow, from 1999. The Rainbow album from 1999 by Mariah Carey. So what do you think about this album? What's, what, what do you like most and what do you like most? I would have to go song by song well, to tell ya. <laughs> okay, let's go with her first song, which is Heartbreaker. Yes, Heartbreaker, the original version with Jay-Z. It's very fun, very playful. Her vocals are awesome. Next. Um, the next one would be Can't Take That Away. Can't Take That Away. Which I believe is her It's her anthem? theme song. It's okay. her anthem. Mariah's anthem. And it's for good reason, too. It's a very empowering, empowering, very strong, structured song. Okay, the next one is Bliss. Bliss! It's a very sensual, very slow mood song. Uh, and she does her whistle register throughout the whole song, which is very impressive. When you hear that whistle, what, what happens? What do you first think of? I have eargasms. Your what? Eargasms. What are those? Eargasms, mindgasms, and bodygasms. Okay, very interesting. The fourth song of the album is How Much, featuring Usher. What do you think about that song? Uh, it's not as good as the other ones. It's not an attention grabber like, Hey, 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 listen to me. But it's... It's cute. Not bad. Next. After Tonight is her fifth song. What do you feel about that one? I feel that After Tonight is similar. It reminds me a lot of the song My All. And it's almost a continuation of it. And it really reminds me of My All. It's not bad. It's good. I like it. Wow. Well, coming up is one of my very, very favorite ones. Which, which one is, is that? Ex-Girlfriend. Ex-Girlfriend. That is one of her favorites. Uh, that song is it's, it's very like, Bish, that's my man. Up on my face. Back up. Kind of a song. It's very funny. So we like it. The next one is the... Heartbreaker remix featuring the brat and, and Missy, Missy Elliott. Elliot. Yes, yes, yes. It's just as good as the original. It's just as fun and festive. Very good song. The next one is her eighth song, which is Vulnerability. Vulnerability, which is, if I'm correct, an interlude to the song Against All Odds. You are correct. Yes, I'm correct. But it is still a very good interlude. And um, Against the Old Odds is one of her favorites and one of my favorites as well. It's a very good song. It's a cover from the Phil Collins original version. And she does it beautifully. Glad you like that song. That's actually one of my favorites. Okay. It's a good song. The next one is also a very good song. Called Cry Baby featuring Snoop Dogg. Cry Baby. This one reminds me a bit of Breakdown, but not as sad. It's more of a you're making me miserable and I can't take it anymore. No more. Enough of enough. Kind of a song. Very good. The next one is <gasps> Did I Do That? Did you, girl? Did I do that? Eh, it's like how much. Not an attention grabber. 
it's good, and she's being quite naughty in this song, but it's still a cute song. Next! What do you think about the song Pedals? Pedals! Oh! Pedals! I would imagine that this is a very personal song for Mariah um, because it's about her family, the douchebag Tommy Matola. And um, it's very strong and heartfelt. Her next song is number 13, Rainbow, which is also the name of her album. Interlude, the Rainbow Interlude. See, Petals is very um, mournful, I guess, in a way, grieving almost. But the mood is lifted higher with the Rainbow Interlude, and it's her way of saying, Yes, all this stuff has been done to me, and bad stuff has happened, but there is a rainbow coming, and I'll be okay. Okay, very good. And last, but not least, thank God I found you featuring Joe and NBA yes. Degrees. Yeah, yes. Thank God I found you. It's like... It's similar to One Sweet Day in the sense that it's done with a group, but it's more of a lovey, dovey, happy, um, I'm glad we're together kind of a song. So, yeah. Okay, so right here, I have a poster of Mariah Carey. Oh, goodness. What Look, do you this think is of the that? booklet that comes with the CD, and when you unfold it, BAM, baby! Look at those freaking legs! She has always had beautiful legs. And now, on a different note, I hear there's a song with your name on it that goes, "Willie, I need yes, you." Yes, I it swear. Like in the in the song, "How Much," at one point, it's as if she's saying, "Willie, you're the only one for me," and I swear that's what she's saying. I swear. But overall, the album is very good from beginning to finish, and I would give it. 9.5 out of 10. It's a job well done, Mariah. I love you. I worship you. We... Lady Gaga, Gloria Trevi, and Mariah Carey. Bye, guys. Yeah.